All right, welcome back, everybody. Um, I don't want to wait too long to get more people who may have lost them to the to the tournament. Um, let's see, make sure Ethan is here. Hello. Oh, oh great, Ethan. I appreciate you being here. And just, uh, I am recording this. Um, Ethan, I think uh, when we initially started, and I know you had to step away, um, I told the group you know, we'd had a, a, some email uh, communications about your equity slash resiliency um, subgroup. And I know you haven't had an opportunity to meet. Um, and I was wondering if if you envision that becoming a reality before, you know, in a, in a, in a manner that we are in a time that we can still incorporate this into the report again. And I know it was obviously a last minute subgroup, probably weren't anticipating that. And I, and I know that everybody's got a ton of stuff going on, especially with the legislature in session. And to that point, let me offer my apologies to everyone. I got out of my keys there with the <laughs> uh, amount of work that uh, I, I threw at us and at this time period. And now I'm faced with a situation where Many over the next month, there are multiple people out on spring breaks. For instance, Jacob out looking at the Aurora Borealis, lucky man. Um, if Passover comes at the end of April, we are not able to marshal the resources to have the discussion with you that I wanted. Um, and I, I apologize sincerely for that. Resiliency, especially for disadvantaged communities, is one of my. Uh, it's a baby topic of mine. It's just something I've been working on for a year. And so what I wanted to offer, um, and I still have the list of people, uh, we will pick that up once we get through this, uh, the final report for the DSP work group. And we can do that outside of this process. There's no reason it has to be included here. And that way we can have some a fulsome conversation. And we'll also be informed by the various legislation that everyone's been talking about. Uh, it, it's a very um, right now everyone's kind of not sure what we have what we're going to have next so we will have that context going into a, another conversation and I will have all the people I need to bring to the table to talk to you about the kind of resiliency plans we do have but right now it's just in order to get all of the consensus items we wanted to work through uh, I, I, I erred by making that offer at this time I wish I'd come up with this a year ago. So my apologies, and I will promise to pick this up post-April. No no apology necessary. Uh, again, um, I know everybody's busy. Again, time of year is not ideal, and we're kind of late in the process, so no apology uh, needed. Um, Nonetheless, but, um, I'm Catholic, so <laughs> apologies come very easy. Um, yeah, I'm very familiar with Catholic guilt. There you go. Um, also, while I have the mic, I just wanted to uh, – we've had a little colloquy um during lunch in addition to trying to grab some food i kind of failed at that and only managed to bring the food to my desk um but uh we were talking about uh, where we in opc are and what we recognize now is the, the main point of uh, non-consensus between us and opc's proposal is hearings or not in the area that i think we could work on if opc would like to sit down with us and this would be pretty much just the PHI and BG&E teams, um, is finding a way to accommodate what they're envisioning that would accommodate the MYP as well and keep the two from conflicting. And because you know our, our uh, MYP team is very interested in using the DSP process also to inform the MYP to reduce the amount of um, confusion and allow for more information for stakeholders so if the opc team would be willing we would love to sit down and see if we can come up with consensus on that and then just leave you know everyone admit okay hearings are a non-consensus item that's fine but if we could find a way to work with uh bill and tim on on accommodating MYP in this process that would be very much appreciated right well it, it sounds more like it's the type of hearing um and I know you you may have missed it, but I think um, again the joint utilities were envisioning like an, something much less than a, a litigated rate case type proceeding. But but um, but hopefully I know Bill indicated that they were open to discussing that. So hopefully um, you know you guys can make some uh, some headway or at least have a discussion offline. I, I'm 
just wanted to make sure that we re-extended that invitation. Because... No, I appreciate it. And that was that was going to be on my to-do list anyway to uh, remind uh, Tim. Tim's in favor of it, so at least there's two of you that are on board with it. Um, and to Thanks, the, Tim. and Al's all, all on board as well. And uh, Tim and Bill and T I'm not sure who was going to be uh, interested in participating in that. So uh, if there's anybody out there, and I'll throw it in the email post um, post meeting today. Uh, to contact Tim uh, and Bill if you would like to be interested or like to be um, uh, contacted and participate in that kind of little, little offline meeting slash subgroup. Very much appreciated. Right. And, and, and contact Jake. <laughs> Jake, I, I promised Jake I would leave him alone <laughs> for this period. Yeah, in, in, in all honesty, he took up some time for me while I had to be out dealing with some uh, uh, medical issues, and I'm happy to give return that favor to him. He's, he, he's just out for today, so thank you. Maybe it's cloudy. Maybe he's not seeing the Borealis. So, all right. I think y'all are talking about no, different, I'm, Jake. different Jakes. I'm talking about my uh, Jake Oshlander. I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Uh, so we we're talking about about Bill Fields. Oh, okay. Yeah. So okay. reach out to Jake as well. Okay. Fantastic. All right, I got it. Do you want Do you want to be in on that email, Bill? I don't want want you to get more emails than you already get. Yeah, it'd probably be be uh, most efficient to reach out to Jake and Tim. All right. Okay. We'll do. All right, I'll do that. All right. With that, um, move on to the utility straw man. Um, I know this this was presented last um, last meeting. Uh, we got a little bit uh, ahead of that, not a not a huge uh, amount of time ahead of that meeting. Does anyone have any comments or questions or concerns? Uh, I know we talked about, about it a little bit uh, this morning, but I wanted to give folks an opportunity. Nobody? And, it, and again, it looked like the only issue of non-consensus in that um in that straw man was in step four it's like um roman numeral three where opc and um paul verchinsky had noted they wanted uh, plans to to be approved by the commission whereas the um utilities envision more of a filing for in informational purposes so unless there's other points of contention or concern, um, is there anything else we need to talk about with in, re in relates in, in relation to the utilities position? And again, this seems like it's more of a geared towards the transparency part of it. Go ahead, Al. Yeah, I just um, I think you already flagged the part about um, making that we were talking about the future looking it's called a report but it's really right yep 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 your issues notwithstanding so uh i think jacob is uh um hopefully he'll be addressing those okay thanks okay all right anybody else all right uh here's a question and i'm i've been grappling with this um how these uh how these straw men positions should be incorporated into the report. I've already got, got them summarized. Um, but, you know, obviously these, uh, the straw men hit on various points throughout. Um, I mean, I can try and break down, take pieces of, especially the OPC straw man and put it um, in the, what, what appear, appears to be the uh, appropriate um, slot or uh, section of the report, um, but I'm not sure the best way to do it. Anybody have a suggestion? Go ahead, Al. I don't have a suggestion on <laughs> the, the OPC straw man is, is quite detailed, and so it, it actually piece by piece would go into the respective sessions whether it's hosting capacity or right. the ER forecasting mm -hmm. right um and i think once we agree that we do or do not have consensus on those specific points the consensus position could go in as, and or as you have done in some other sections 
the two opposing or three opposing mm -hmm. or whatever alternate suggestions for the commission that could go in. In terms of the um, the utility storm and anticipation, once the little tweaks have been made, um, I would think that it could either be incorporated wholesale or incorporated by by uh, reference directly into the report in the section on participation. It seems to be what we're talking about. Is right. Okay. Great. All right. All right. Yeah, and that's obviously a little less contentious with the exception of the hearing issues. Uh, go ahead, Eric. Yes, Judge, thank you for taking my question. Certainly. Um, just, just on the topic of timing and sequencing, um, just wanted to flag that as, as a concern on our side on, on what was proposed within the um, OPC recommendation. In terms of you know, when you file the discovery, the feedback, and then whether or not there's commission hearing, is that? Yes. Okay. Yep. 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 You know, just, 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 just trying to keep in sync with the other processes that we have going within the utility around seasons and things of that nature. If I recall, um, in in the proposal, there was a a January first date by a certain year that's that's a huge concern on our side it just does not align with with um the the seasonal analysis and processes we have going okay all right thank you sir appreciate yeah. that all right anybody else all right so all right so we're we're done on that all right so um, is there any other issue that we haven't hit today that folks want to hit? I mean, I've got one more thing I'd like to, to discuss, but other than that, um, go ahead, Tim. Uh, I was just going to say, I think, um, I don't, this isn't a separate issue, but I, I think to Al's point, I, I, I'm probably in, um, in agreement that I think, yeah, the, the, a lot of the next step is trying to go through you know, I guess using your summary as like okay. a guide of just hitting every point and then trying to find consensus, not consensus. Okay. All right. Well, why don't we, that was kind of leading me to my, the point I wanted to hit. I think I, I could probably get, a, again, a draft of everything out um, sometime next week, hopefully, you know, no later than Thursday out to everyone. Um, and then you guys could butcher it as you see fit and provide whatever feedback um, uh, that, that we need. Um, you know, and, and to the extent you can give specific uh, suggestions, you know, um, you know, in terms of like language for a recommendation, for example, that'd be great. You know, obviously catching any typos, that would be fine as well. Um, does that, I think that's prob probably the best way to um, proceed and that'll lay out kind of where things stand. All right, so I got Al agreed. Uh, Ethan laughed at me. Tim agrees. Okay, so why don't we why don't we plan on doing that? I'll try and get. Uh, I'm out on Friday and Monday, but I'll try and get something to everyone no later than Thursday. Again, it's a rough draft, um, you know, uh, but I appreciate any feedback folks have. Um, and. Do we want to, it's probably beneficial to, to at least schedule a meeting for, for uh, on the 4th. Um, maybe we don't go as long, but um, if folks want to, do, do we want to meet? Uh, I don't want to force a meeting because I know, again, I know everyone's busy. Um, and it sounds like at least OPC and the joint utilities are going to have some offline discussions. Do we want to plan on having a meeting or do you guys just want to kind of see what happens with those with those discussions? I think we're so close to the end that we need another meeting. To okay. Great. No problem. That's me. That's just me. All right. Yeah, we can certainly have another meeting. Um, I do have a hearing that day at 10 o'clock, but I don't imagine it's going to go long. So we'll plan on meeting um, at 11. If uh, hopefully that won't be an issue for anyone. All right. Uh, anybody else? All right. 
Uh, if uh, somebody has an issue or concern, just shoot me an email um, and I will get a report out as, as soon as I can. All right. I think that works well. Nope. Great. Thank you. you. Guys, oh, no problem. All right. We'll see you. Thank you. Thank you.